phone will be okay. A friend of mine came into town and needed my assistance. I just had to help. I'm, I'm sorry. I don't understand. Why would you make me plan a ladies' night if you knew you wouldn't show up? You kept me waiting. Baby girl, that's why I'm saying I'm sorry now. I apologize. See, anything, anything at all, just name it. I'll make it up to you. I mean, last I checked, I was the bestie, right? I didn't know someone else had taken the place of you. Uh-uh. I didn't tell you you was my best friend. I just said, well, he's very special and I couldn't tell him no, so. <laughs> okay. So I'm guessing this he must be an ex or there's somebody you want to hook up with. I totally understand. Be uh, why? I understand. <laughs> it's not like that now. Elle, why are you doing like this? I've apologized. See, 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 see. To God who made me. You see, I tried your number. I tried and tried and tried. Because some reason the network was just not in my favor. And then when you called, I could barely. Come on, come on, come on. Cut that bull crap of network. No worry now. Say to do, you know the thing. Ah, no. One, no. No, no. No, no, no. no worry. Are you stalking okay. me? You again. So have you gotten over what got you angry last night? It's none of your business. Just take it easy, Tiger. Can I help you out? No. Easy, I'm just trying to be friendly. I don't need your help. Everybody can see that you need help. I'm just trying to be friendly, that's all. It's no big deal. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, all right. So I know we, we got off on the wrong foot, but can I at least just help you? Well, that's the least I can do. Thank you. Uh, please come in. Ah. <laughs> I hope you don't find it too difficult looking no, in the place. No, it will be all right. What would you like to have? What do I'm I have? Okay, nothing. Are you sure? Fine. Fine. <gasps> ah. No, 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 no. It's fine. Hi. Anyway, um, Sam, my best friend, Elma, Elma, my friend, he just came in yesterday, Sam. Nice to meet you. There's a reason you kept me waiting. I'm sorry, I just came in. I wasn't talking. <laughs> Wait, why do I have a feeling that you both know each other? Olivia, and then I noticed that she was shocked when she saw you. Why hey, was she shocked when she... I will call you later, okay? Actually, um, this is my guy I told you about, okay. Sam. Yeah. He's a tech guy. He can actually handle all your projects. Oh. Sam? Yeah. Meet Anderson. Yeah. Pleased to meet you, my man. Likewise, bro. Very good yeah. friend of mine. Um, I hope we'll do a lot of business together. Yeah, looking forward to it. Cheers. Cheers. Ah, oh boy. Who is us? I said I was sorry now. You can't tell me you're still mad over what happened the other time. It's not you again. You just make decisions. You don't even think I'm a good boy. You expect people to just follow you with your decisions. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry. Okay. I beg, I beg, I beg, not to forget me. Oh, yes. I, I was... 
Child, what do you buy? Oh, where is it? Hey, 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 hey. Relax yourself. Sorry. This is for you. Thank you, your love. <laughs> <laughs> no, but... Ah. This is a lot. Where did you get it from? Well, I went on a date. Wait. When did you start keeping this kind of information away from me? <laughs> and who's this lucky guy? I met him out. The day you stood me up. Mm -hmm. And honestly, I don't know, he seems really nice. I think I like him. I know you like him. I you, think. you like him, but you don't think you, you like him. You like him. <laughs> you should even be telling me thank you because you you were not for me vexed at me. And you should be thanking me because you met him too. And that doesn't mean you should stand me up. Anyway. Is he our new boyfriend? Maybe. But I have to get to know him first. It's him. You like him. Hey, but at least, you know, yeah. is he... Okay, girl. Yeah. Since, Since you're smiling from shopping. cheek to cheek, I Please. went shopping. Look. It's him. He got you all Yes. So how's your friend, Elmo? She's fine, actually. She went out with her boyfriend. A boyfriend? She's got a boyfriend. Yes, why do you think a hot chick like her will be single? Well, I was kind of hoping she was still single. Why do you like her? Isn't it obvious? Well, it's a pity she's taken. Ah, uh -uh. yeah. where's the girl? How far? Where to? Where are you going looking all hot and stuff? I have a date. With who? Our boyfriend. Uh, hmm. No, 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 wait. What? He has not earned that title yet. Mm. No, he has not. But he's doing all the things to end the title. Mm. I hear but not you. yet. Nah, so. I hear you. That must be him. Great. That's I get him. to meet him and see if he's worth it. Oh, yeah. Please okay. be no, nice. Just leave it. I'll pack it for you. Okay, okay, okay. okay, okay. Just go and help you. I'll be done in a minute. Hi. Not bad. Excuse me. Hi, I'm Olivia, uh, Elmer's best friend, and you must be Anderson. Yes, nice to meet you. Lovely to meet you too. <laughs> I see you both have met each other. Oh, yes. Uh, now I see who the man that has stolen my best friend's heart is. Ollie! What? I... Okay, all I meant to say was Anderson is a cool guy. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Why? Because she said you're cool. <laughs> Shall we? Let's go. Bye. Bring something new. Now. What's going on? I'm mad at you. Uh -uh. Why would you tell Anderson such rubbish? What are you talking about? You told him he stole my heart from when to when. I haven't even considered dating the guy yet. Babe, what is wrong with you? That dude is a hot specimen. You should hold him tight. I will not date him because he's a hot specimen. Babes, I need to get to know him first. See, he looks responsible and rich. What else do you want? I don't need his money. I'm an accountant and I work in one of the biggest manufacturing companies. I have my own money. I need to know the guy first now. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. How much do you make, Seth? Mm -hmm. how, much, how much do you make? Babe, you need a guy that can take care of you. Okay? And spoil you silly. Ollie, just stop. I need to get to know this guy first. I'm content, okay? Please don't try this thing again. I, I was very embarrassing now. Yeah, no vex. No vex. I got carried away. Sorry. Mm? No, it's all right. You carried away. Sorry. Ah. Okay, then. What's your vibe? I don't buy anything. I'm not telling me you buy something. Come. Come.
Hey, cutie. What are you doing here? Can't you see my girlfriend? Your girlfriend is not here. I am staring at her right now. <laughs> You're delusional. Oh, come on. Don't be like that now. Come on, baby. I miss you. Baby. I'm not your baby. Well, the last time I checked, we never broke up. Ah. Maybe you also can remember waking up one morning and disappearing into thin air, not letting me know where you were. But guess what? I don't care. That was many years ago and we didn't know what we wanted. I know what I want and I know I want you. <laughs> In your dreams. Come on, I want you. Don't touch me! Why are you... What the hell is going on? We are just having a conversation, you know? What stupid conversation were you having that warrants you holding her so intimate? No, wait, 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 wait. Did you forget that she had a boyfriend? I'm very certain you did not forget she had a boyfriend, right? Forget. Okay, Oli. Hey, hey, you. You should be ashamed of yourself. Frolicking with a guy you only just met. You... you know you have a boyfriend. Hey, hey, hey. Boyfriend. Okay, Please keep your hands away from calm my face. Calm down, I beg. Cool down. Mm -hmm. Nothing is going on between Sam and I. Like I was blind. Are you? Okay, please, let's rush. Excuse me. Don't, 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 don't push me, oh. Don't push me. He's man now. You know how to follow. Don't tell me how or how I shouldn't talk to my friend, okay? okay? All right, I can see you're pissed off. Okay, so I'll just leave you, give you time to calm down, and I'll see you later. Okay? Whatever. Wait, wait, wait. How can you All even right. be just... Nice place. Thank you. You look amazing. Thank you. Mm. So, tell me, what are we celebrating? Us. I really like you, <laughs> Alma. I think you're very beautiful and I want us to be an item. <laughs> an item? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, you're a really nice guy, all right? You're, you're, you're nice. And to be honest, I like you too, but don't you think we're moving too fast? No, I'm a guy who goes for what he wants. Hmm. I want you. Frankly speaking, I'm surprised you're still single. Oh well, I did break up with my ex and I just wanted to be alone for a while. Is he blind? Oh. How can a man let a woman like you go? It's complicated. What about you? Well, I had a girlfriend. Um, but yes, yeah, she, she, she ran off with a son of a guy and got married, so hey. Wow. Well, maybe she thought you would never marry her. Well, I wasn't ready. That's the truth. And I'm happy, actually, that I wasn't because I wouldn't have met you. Okay, that's enough. Enough with flattering, just stop. I'm not flattering, it's the truth. <laughs> it's the truth. Hey. Is that how you just barge into people's houses Calm now? Calm down, it's only a bit sarcastic. I mean, the door was in the lock. I just walked in, you saw me, right? What do you want? The last time I was here, we didn't get a chance to talk. There's nothing to talk about. Come on, babes. We have unfinished business. What unfinished business? Okay, so you're suddenly interested in me again because you met me coincidentally? It's no coincidence. I've been looking for you. Hmm. I found out that Olivia was your best friend, you know? And we actually went to... We did service together. And I knew you were living with her, so I came to visit. <laughs> you're causing some serious misunderstanding between my friend and I. And I don't like it. You need to stop coming here to see me. Uh, I don't really care if this makes Olivia uncomfortable. I want to see you. I came to see you. She has feelings for you. Well, we're just friends, not anymore. Yeah, but she doesn't know that. Listen, I have a boyfriend, all right? So you need to stop bugging me. Look, I don't care about that. I want you back. I'm not going to stop if I you. Ugh. <sighs> 
Why am I thinking about him? Nothing can happen between us, so why am I thinking? I, uh, I noticed that Sam has been coming here often to see you. Are you into him? That's a stupid question. You know I'm in a relationship. In a relationship? Do I look stupid to you? No, do I look stupid to you? You think I don't know there's something going on between the two of you? Why can't you just leave him the hell alone? Leave him alone and focus on Anderson. Is that, is that too difficult for you? I can't, okay, is it a crime that I came and introduced him to you? Why are you here? Is it a crime? Must you put your eyes in things that are not yours? When you learn how to talk or have a conversation, I will ignore your condescending talk. You see, this will be the last time I'll come and tell you to leave me alone, okay? You have your boyfriend, but no, you refuse. You will want to just put your eyes in the one that is not yours. I won't come here again. I won't come here again. This will be the last time. Hmm. So I'm thinking of, um, of expanding, you know, opening a chain of businesses. What kind of business were you thinking of? Superstores, you know, selling customized goods. And it's my job to make sure it stands out from the others. Mm -hmm. I always stand out. Mm. Hey, babe. Hey. Yes, uh, th this, this is Sam. He's a good friend of mine. Hi. Uh, hi, I'll, um, <clears throat> I'll just wait downstairs. Okay. So I've been speaking to some manufacturing companies. They're going to be manufacturing goods for the superstores. Yeah, um, I want to use nice and kind. Yeah, yeah, sure. The restaurant. Oh, yeah. Thank you. The restaurant is downstairs. All right, let's meet and talk over a drink at the weekend. Yeah, sure. All right. We take it easy. Okay. Okay. Easy, huh? Yeah. Baby big girl. Ah, ah. How far? How you there? My dear. Where are you coming from? Anderson's place. I went to Anderson. Uh, you know, I saw Sam there. I didn't even know they knew each other. Sam? Mm -hmm. What was he doing there? I, I don't know. How do they know each other? I didn't bother to ask, to be honest. Well, Anderson is into tech, right? Mm -hmm. And Sam is a private investigator. Mm -hmm. So at some point, they must have done business together. Honestly, I don't care. I'm, I'm tired. <gasps> Have you seen the beauty on Sam's status? I don't have any business with Sam's status. Mm. Anyway, she's his niece, and today's her birthday. I only wish she could celebrate it with Harsha. Why? But maybe story for another day, don't worry. I'll tell you. Go buff. I'm coming. I rang the bell this time. <laughs> Welcome, Sam. Hey, baby girl. 
Okay, Sam, you need to stop with that, all right? Please, just sit down. Yeah. I heard about your niece. That must be so hard. I'm sorry. Yeah. That's why I worry about you. I need you to be careful. <laughs> I am. I can't lose you, you know. Okay, is there something you're not telling me? You don't want to lose me, be careful. What is going I on? I just need you to be careful because if anything happens to you, I'll never forgive myself. Nothing will happen. I'm... Listen, you don't have to care for me, all right? I can take care of myself. Plus, my man can take care of me. Don't worry, I'm fine. I just need you to be safe. Sure. To take very good care of yourself. Okay. So have you apologized to your friend after how you spoke to her the last time? I'm seated right in front of you. Yet you don't see me. You only have eyes for her. <sighs> Olivia, come on. You are like a sister to me. I don't have feelings to you like that. Come on. But you see her like that, despite the fact that she has a boyfriend. Calm down. Please don't tell me to calm down, okay? Wait, what is it that she has that I don't? Look, Alma and I, we have history. I was the first love. Now I get it. Now I get it. So you two are trying to what? We can do old flames? See, she's with Anderson and she refused to give me a second chance. So I guess, you know. Lies. Um, that's, that's it. All lies. So you two are trying to date or you are even dating and that's why you have refused okay, to give Olivia, us a chance, listen, isn't it? See, even if there was no... Oh my, I, I, me and you can't... I don't feel, I don't feel like that towards you. You might, you might, gee, you might, my main person. Ah, come on. I get it. Olivia, babe. You lying whistle. So you've been sleeping with him behind my back, right? What the hell are you talking about? Please, 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 don't just form ignorance. Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking. You, you've been sleeping with Sam. You and Sam were lovers. Yes or no? Why did you keep the information away from me? Well, you didn't give me a chance to tell you. Lies. From the pit of hell. You wanted to rekindle low flames. Is that not what you wanted to do? You wanted to keep sleeping with him while you kept your boyfriend lying, lying Okay, him. that's enough. That's enough. Do not talk to me in such condescending manner. And what will happen? What? You're pushing me. <laughs> what would you do? Lying whistle. What would you do? Ha. Did you touch me? Babe, did you touch me? Oh, you want to steal my man now? You want to beat me on top, Abby? I sent you an email with the information you requested for. Did you get it? No, no, no. I haven't, I haven't checked my email. I've been really busy. But tell me, how much would it cost? I'd send the money to your account so you can try acquire the equipment. Um, all necessary information um, of price in the account to be sent to was actually an email. Um, mm -hmm. Once payment is made, then delivery and inst installation will take place immediately. Okay. All right, that's beautiful. So I would, um, I'll check the email and I'll get back to you. Okay. But how is David? It's been a while. I haven't, I haven't been able to reach him. His phone's been, you know. David is fine. I mean, he went to be on to his village to do the uh, introduction to get yeah, married, you know. That's true. That's true. He mentioned that, actually. Yeah, he'll be back um, sometime next week. You're going to have to make me a drink, or I'm just going to sit down and look at you. <laughs> Are you still seeing him? 
How is that any of your business? You didn't heed my advice after what I told you? I don't understand this. You're warning me against your own friend. Why? It's for your own good. And besides, I doubt if you have feelings for him. Oh, well, I do. You sure about that? No, I, I mean, yes. Yes, of course. I, I have feelings for Anderson. You have a funny way of showing me that. Try this. You're still in love with me, aren't you? Don't deny it. Hey, what is it? Now, listen that you have got a body in your ear and you cannot hear. Can you just leave this man alone and go and be with your man? Oliver, is this a problem? Oliver, will you just stop? Stop what? Stop what? Why are you not telling her to stop it? Why are you telling me to stop it? She's just a pretender. Do you get it? She wants to eat her cake and have... Okay, cake. fine. I've heard enough. Excuse me. Hey, 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 you, you, where do you think you are going to? You want to follow her? You want to go and connect, continue what you started upstairs, Abby? What? Why are you being unreasonable? I'm not being unreasonable, okay? I'm not the one being unreasonable. You told you are hiding things from me. Why would you do that? You need to go back and apologize to Apologize her. for what? To who? Well, she lost all her respect the moment she started selling herself to you. Olivia. Hmm? Sam. Why now? No, if I had not stopped you, you would have followed her, B. Right, friends, stay, 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 stay where you are. Where are you going? You're going to be with him. Save John. My friend, I say shifts. You see what you've caused? What did I cause? You see what you've caused? What did I cause? You see what you've caused? She's going to be with her boyfriend where she should be in the first place. I don't know why it's peppering you. Are you going to drink something? Uh. She has gone, no. She has entered her Uber and she has left. I cannot even meet her day again. Hello? Yeah, babe. Who? Who now? Head of department. Oh, babe, just made a why she dang man they follow me now. Just 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 find something and tell, tell her I went to the field to market some insurance to some mega company. Or, or which paperwork again? Babe, help me sort it out, eh? Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Okay, I can't walk then. I think that's every time, every time. Okay. Let's see what you got. There you go, boy. <laughs> and there you oh. go. <laughs> My man, how fun. How did the introduction go now? Yeah, we thank God. We thank God. Actually, traditional marriage has been fixed. Okay. For last Sunday in September. I can't wait to tie the knot with that girl. Ooh, my man is really in love. Oh. Ha! I hope you feel the same way too, though. Yes, of course. You know, I don't believe in love, though. Love is for simps. <laughs> I thought you were head over heels with your girl. Well, um, you know, we just started dating and uh, still. Damn. Ooh, okay, still early days, actually. So I'm preparing to tame her to be submissive to my sexual desires. What is that supposed to mean? Well, I'm an alpha male. And um, I like to tame women, no matter how fierce they appear to be. Okay. Wait until you fall in love. 
You would do anything to get her. Like I said before, Dave, I don't believe in love is for sims. <laughs> That's what a man who can get a real woman to fall in love with him says. I mean, love is a beautiful thing. God. God. Wow. If you know I'm fall in love, no problem. But don't force your opinion on others. If I didn't know you, David, I would think you were a simp. But I know you. You're a real man. See, no woman deserves to be treated specially. They don't want the stress. That's the truth. The woman you're with, you don't think she's worth the stress. Oh, no, she is special, but she's not worth the stress yet. Until I can tame her to submit to me totally. Yeah. <laughs> and that's all. Don't allow this in your ego to affect your relationship. I treat my woman like the queen she is. Huh? But my ego makes her respect me more. Anyway, Sam, what about you? Anybody special in your life? Yes. And I will destroy any man who tries to hurt her. Uh, uh. Sam! I thought you were single. Well, not for long, I guess. I hope. Wait. Wait, wait. You mean you'll be running show behind me? Can I just play? Is it okay? Can I, can I play? Huh. Watch your shot. Say, what, say hey, what, what, you both get a room. What I want to do. Right, just get a room. <laughs> <laughs> Babe, the head of the department was so pissed today that he didn't show up for work. And there are some files you are supposed to work on. Miss, you free me now. Miss, you just free me. There are some documents you are supposed to attend to. I had to do them for you. I covered up. And the worst part is I liked that you were in field. Thank you. Why did you not come to work today? Babe, see, I was just exhausted. I was stressed, okay? I needed to take a break. You went clubbing, right? Which club? My work won't finish me. I guess relax. Wow. Now, wow. Peggy. By the way, where is your friend, um, Elma? I've not seen her around. She should be fine. What do you mean she should be fine? You guys don't stay together anymore. I beg rest now. You don't ask. I said she should be fine. She will be fine where she is. Ah. Thanks for coming to check up on me. Oh, very soon. I'm a man for matter we no concern. Thank you. Are you coming to work tomorrow? I will be there. For the special day. Why is he always sneaking out? 
Oh, where is he always sneaking out? If you don't stop calling me baby, I will stop picking your calls. You know you're the reason my friend and I are having issues. Oh, whatever. What's up? Why are you calling? Of course, I'm fine. You know today's Anderson's birthday? Yeah, of course, I know you know that. Um, I'm trying to plan a surprise get-together. I don't know, maybe you could call one or two of his friends and you can come over. I'm not in town. Really? Where are you? Yeah, yeah. Where's Anderson? Anyway, let me just. I'm thinking of resigning. I'm thinking of resigning because all these targets they keep giving us is, is, is unnecessary now. How are we supposed to meet these unrealistic targets? Ah, I'm tired though. See who is complaining. You that, is, that have a whole lot of clients, you're meeting your targets back to back. So what would you say to someone like me that is barely trying to survive? Really? Babe. Babe, I beg. You're doing so well. So well. Don't let anybody come and pressure you. I'm just tired of the pressure, that's all. Well, the pay and the commission is good. I'll advise you not to resign. I don't tire. All I want to do now is just go for a vacation and forget work. Is that too much to ask? Why don't you apply for a leave? Oh. Or better still, vacation leave or something? Oh. I've exhausted my leave for the year. Now apply for a sick leave. Ha! Auntie, you bad though. <laughs> <laughs> yes, now there is always a way out for everything. The street is crazy, man. That's, that's, that's what okay. about Emma? I've been coming here. I've not seen her. You don't get her number. Answer, Joe. I bet. See, 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 please now. It's okay. Ah. I don't want to talk about her. She's a backstabbing friend, please. Do you want anything to drink? I'm here to ask him about it.
are you doing here? Why are you, why are you chained? What? What is happening? What is this? Save me from the monster, please. Yes. Monster? Who is the monster? What, what, what monster? Anderson. Anderson. Anderson would never do this. Why? Anderson is... Oh, no. Anderson couldn't have done this. See, Anderson is innocent. Why would you... Yes. Handsome demon. Yes, save me. Okay, save me. Okay. What help you? What? How, how do I? What, how do I? Sorry, no, 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 shh, shh. Do you want to get him in? So, one step, let's go, shh. Hello? Hi, Lydia. Hi. How are you doing? I'm fine. I'm where you left me. Come and show me the safari bed back to Anderson. Can you go with my sister? Wait. Hold on. So you're calling me because Elma is throwing a surprise party for Anderson and I should go and help her. Help her do what? Wash plates. See, guy, 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 please, let this be the last time you will call me for anything concerning her. Am I clear? I be like a house girl. Wait, these people don't even raise me. Aha! Oh, wow. See, finish. I don't even sleep again. Okay, we're almost there. We're almost there. It's okay. We're almost there. Just. We're almost there. Yes, we're almost there. We're almost there. I'm sorry. We're almost there, please. Let's just do this. Anderson. And what do you think you're doing? How? What? Anderson. You've just crossed the line. She needs to get to a hospital. You've just crossed the line. Anderson! Last time you heard from your friend. Wait, did you come here to see me or talk about Elma? I've been trying to call her for a couple of days. She's not picking up a call. I mean, it's kind of weird. There's nothing weird about it. Maybe she's finally decided to receive sense and cut you off. All right, well, we just, we just stop, okay? She's not picking up a call. Her phone is switched off. That is kind of odd. There's nothing odd about it. If you ask me, she's probably going to be with her boyfriend and they are, you know, having their honeymoon. Maybe we should just Oliver, oh, will you just stop? <clears throat> huh? I've told you I see you as my sister. Don't don't, over, don't please don't overstep again. But I'm not your sister. Try and call her now. 
Ah, ah, problem day. Ah. Hey, where are these? They're mine, and I think they'll look good on you. an innocent lady for God knows how long. And you say you're okay? Now she was my girlfriend before I... I met you. I was, I was thinking of letting her go when you officially replaced her. You're not okay. You need help. Aren't you curious to hear her story? No! Why would I want to hear a sick story of how you've kept an innocent lady locked up against her will? Why? I'm going to tell you anyway, so you don't make the same mistake. Oh my God. Now, um, I had a beautiful relationship with a girl, Valentina. And everything was going well. Until... Mm. 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 Wait, 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 just wait. Oh, you've not been satisfying me sexually, so um, I want to teach you how. BDSM. That's not the way it works. I tell you what to do, and you do it. You don't ask questions. All right? <laughs> that is absurd. I want out. Hey, hey, hey. hey. No, leave me be. Anderson! Anderson, no, please! Please, 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 Anderson, please don't do this. Anderson, please. It's not until you do what I want. No. Anderson, there are many women out there that can do what you want. I can't. You don't have a choice now, do you? You just let go. No, you don't get to choose. Let go! <laughs> Get to choose. No, I'm not no, please. I'm not saying no, You're crying. You Listen, I'm not going to lock you up if you, if you cooperate. You kept an innocent girl. You will never go unpunished. Something will happen to me. I can make her disappear without a trace. And if you're stubborn, the same fate will await you. You monster. You will meet your end. Don't worry. I'll be gentle with you. You're my girl. I would rather die than succumb to this madness. Don't touch me! And you better get used to it. I warned you now. You're sick. I'm a 
untouchable. Yeah, this son of a guy, mm -hmm. have you been able to gather any incriminating evidence against him? So far from what I've seen in his queen. But you know, there's something fishy about him. My investigative hunch go wrong. Okay. Do let me know if you find anything concrete. Yeah. Anyway, how are things? Ah, things have not been the same since you left the house. Ah, come on. You're a lot of capable hands there. Ah, not as efficient as you. <laughs> you just used to working with me, that's all. So, how's the family though? Ah, family is fine. I hope you will settle that soon. <laughs> well, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully. Please do. Yeah. Look at you. I, I, I brought you some goodies because I want you to enjoy yourself. I don't want goodies. I just want to go home. Please. If only you know how much I love you. How much I cherish you. I will literally do anything for you. That's why, that's why I want to make you mine completely. This is not how to show love. You're getting it all wrong. You can't tie me against my will. Listen, I know what you feel. I know how you feel about me. That's why I want to do those things to you. Just stop resisting, submit to me. A love relationship is consensual. Bodies have to agree. If you truly love me and you want me to reciprocate, you have to let me go. Anderson! Babe, what's up? See, I'm not okay at all. I'm not okay, I'm angry. What's happening? Is it, is it not that girl? What's that? Elma. She stole my man. Elma. <laughs> I'm sorry, but why would she do that to you? Because she's selfish. That is why. Okay, I introduced her to a guy that I had a crush on. Coincidentally, and he happens to be her ex. Okay, now they've gone behind my back to rekindle their relationship. Can you imagine? Slow down. Did you tell her that you have a crush on this guy? Please, that's not the point. That's not the point at all. The point is that she stole my man. That's why the fact that she has a boyfriend. Now my man only has eyes for her. What's that? I thought you said he's your crush. So when did he become your man? He friend zoned me because of her. I really doubt it's because of it. Mm. Newscaster, you doubt. P whose side are you on? The truth. Can't you see what's in front of you? I can see. I this saw. story is not adding up. Mm -hmm. Go make peace with please, your friend. Eh, eh, please, don't get me out. In fact, you know what? Thank you. Come and go. Olivia. You heard me, you are not deaf. Stand up and leave the house. What has come over you? I will throw you out too. Oh yeah, outside. Hey. I got you some food. Oh. Isn't this romantic? 
now so I need you to eat so that you can have strength for tonight that will be over my Trust me, you're going to really like this and you ask for more, so here you go. This is my man. <laughs> yeah. Sam, hi. Um, How you doing? I'm I'm good. What are you? I I, I tried to call you, but my battery is dead. Oh. I was in the vicinity. My car broke down somewhere. And I, I was gonna go to the hotel, but I thought, hey, my man Anderson, who lives around the corner, you know? Yeah. Oh uh, yeah. Yeah. Listen, if it's not convenient, I could always. I could leave. I no, mean, no, 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 uh, no, no. Not at all. Please, please, please. Okay. Really, yeah, please. No. I mean, I don't really want to, you know, inconvenience you, especially if your woman is around. No, 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 no. I'm, 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 I'm actually alone. You know, and, and even if she was, she wouldn't have issues with it. Huh. Yeah. Um, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you sure? I mean, I could go to a hotel. No, and say, no, no. Stay, stay. It's, it's fine. It's fine. But do I, uh, do I get you anything to drink? No, I'm okay. I'm okay. I'm okay. Thank okay. you. Yeah, well, I think I'll, I'll go to bed. It's pretty late and um, I've had a really stressful day, so. Yeah, I'm, I'm tired as well. Mm. Yeah. So. Yeah, let me show you to the room. Okay. Yeah, so. Uh, All right. There's just, that's it. You know. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So that's, that's it. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Okay. So, uh, good night then. Yeah, good night. Yeah. 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 <laughs> No, I don't think I should call her. Her being with Anderson is better off. If I call her now, it reduces my chances of be hooking up with Sam. So I'm not going to call her. No, I'm call. I'm back. I hope you didn't miss me too much. Hopefully you'll behave tonight. Okay, and then there'll be no need for this. Baby, come. Shh. Stay. Bye. 
So what are you doing snooping around my house? What is your mission here? Hey, Anderson. I think we found that drug of knife. You know what they say about the stolen fly? Follows the corpse into the grave. Thank you. Thank you for coming. And this thing is a psycho. He has yeah. another girl locked up. Where? In the other room. All right. All right. Um. Oh my God, thank you. Thank you. Okay. Did I get the right key? Okay, you know what? I'm going to try. Go to the hospital as well, you know. I'll come and join you guys later on. So as I get that cycle arrested. It's okay. Come. What are you doing here? You were supposed to be on your way to the hospital. I'm fine. Trust me, I'm, I'm, I'm okay. I just need to experience this beast to get what he deserves. This is the end of the road for this cycle. You will pay for the pain you put my niece and Elma through. Valentina's your niece. Why do you think I got close to you? I have been investigating you for a while now. I gathered information about you. You were the last person to see my niece before she disappeared. And I knew you knew something. Listen, I love her. You love who? Listen, listen to me. She just refused to do what I wanted. I never intended to harm her or Elma. I just I hear these voices. I have this multiple personality that just causes me to, to cause harm. To the people. Well, shut your mouth. Multiple 
personality is my foot. What nonsense is that? Psychosis. I hear voices. And they tell me to harm the woman that I love. You know what? You will hear those voices in a psychiatric home. You don't deserve to be among sane human beings. Okay, listen. I didn't mean to hurt you. Please. Elmer, please. Hey, hey! Stop, please, Elmer. stop talking to her. Elma! Elma! Thank you for coming. He's in there. Okay. Where is he? Thank you for coming so quickly. Thank you. Oh, uh, we will need uh, Valentina to stick with us so she recovers. Uh, we also need a signature. That's fine. Um, she will give a statement when she comes from the hospital. I will come if need be, testify against her. I, I would also come and write my statement. Officer, please. He needs help. He's psycho. Yeah, we'll Thank you. Alright, I appreciate it. Trying. Mm. I can't thank you enough. It's nothing. It's everything. Look, I gotta go back to the hospital. I need to be when Valentina wakes up. Yeah, I understand. I mean, she's been through the worst. I feel so sorry for her. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Make any sense? Mm -hmm. Yeah. I cost more for me. Mm -hmm. You haven't told me what happened to Sam's niece. Well, she left home one day and never returned. I don't understand. <laughs> what do you mean? Well, okay, they said she went to see her boyfriend, mm -hmm. right? And they never found her. She never went back home. They asked the boyfriend. He said eh, she came there with her, but when she came, she briefly left. She didn't stay too long. And that he didn't know her whereabouts. Uh-uh. They should arrest that guy. Sharp, sharp. Exactly what I said. He knows about it. Of course now. And but they investigated. They said they found some evidence that showed that, you know, he was telling the truth that she left briefly. Sam heard, but he was out of the country when all of this happened. Mm -hmm. And then he vowed that once he returned, he was going to look for her. He returned, started looking for her, and he's still been looking for her. Mm -hmm. His effort has been foot up. So loud. He loud, he choke. <laughs> I didn't even realize she was his second victim. That guy dehumanized her. I couldn't even recognize her after I saw her. He will pay for this, don't you too? Where's Olivia, Sharon? Honestly, I haven't seen her since I got her. Lovebirds. So you people don't even hide to do it anymore. You now do it in public. I can see you've been out living your best life. I could have died. And you wouldn't even notice. 
so much for being a best friend. You never cared about me. You were never concerned about me. It's fine. You know what? What is it with you? Your friend was kidnapped, held against the world for days. And here you are. You didn't even notice. Instead, you're engulfed in your jealousy. What? 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 What are you talking about? Who was what am I talking about? You need to apologize to her. You know, all this you're doing, it's not cool. Excuse Wait, who you. was kidnapped? Elma. Elma, I'm sorry, okay? I'm really sorry. I didn't know what you were going through. I didn't know you were going through hell and I was here burning in jealousy. I'm sorry, please. I can't just believe your attitude. You're meant to be my best friend. I don't understand. Nothing can justify what I did. I'm sorry. Please help. Just forgive me, please. Don't give me that face. Sorry. Thank you. <laughs> ah, but we do. This life is tough. Hmm. Like, who would have thought? Hmm. Like, ugh. so Anderson is actually the devil's incarnate. Hmm. I didn't even know anything like that was happening. Anderson. And then he was Valentina's ex. Mm -hmm. Who would have, I didn't know. Hmm. Anderson. Honestly, me, I'm just very thankful right now. But you know Sam didn't mention anything. But to be honest, if he had, I I would not have married him. I would have just thought he was trying to get me to, to just break up with Anderson for his own selfish reasons. That's why he had been telling you not to be with him on along with us. Okay. Have you eaten? What would you like to have? I'm ready to pound the arm for you. Anything. Mm. Come on, go ahead. <laughs> A bit. Just rest there. I'll come back and check up on you. Thanks, babe. Sorry, eh? I'm so happy Valentina has been found. And alive, too. <laughs> yeah. Good to have you back. Thank you very much. She insisted on seeing Alma before going home. Okay, uh, let me help you get her. Okay. Hey. Hey. So I will be going back at the end of the month. Why? You literally just moved to Lagos. Why are you leaving so soon? Well, I'm done with what I came to do, so I'll be going back to Abuja. Why? Shouldn't I? I mean, there's nothing keeping me here. Okay. If you say so. If you don't want me, if you don't want me to go, I mean, Stay if you think there's a chance that we could. Don't go. I will stay for you. So, so officially, <laughs> we're back together. We are back together, right? Mm. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>